Chapter 13 On that day a fountain will be opened for the dynasty of David and for the people of Jerusalem, a fountain to cleanse them from all their sins and defilement. And on that day, says the Lord Almighty, I will get rid of every trace of idol worship throughout the land, so that even the names of the idols will be forgotten. I will remove from the land all false prophets and the unclean spirits that inspire them. If anyone begins prophesying again, his own father and mother will tell him, You must die, for you have prophesied lies in the name of the Lord. Then his own father and mother will stab him. No one will be boasting then of a prophetic gift. No one will wear prophet's clothes to try to fool the people. No, he will say, I'm not a prophet. I'm a farmer. The soil has been my means of livelihood from my earliest youth. And if someone asks, then what are those scars on your chest? He will say, I was wounded at the home of friends. Awake, O sword, against my shepherd, the man who is my partner, says the Lord Almighty. Strike down the shepherd, and the sheep will be scattered, and I will turn against the lambs. Two-thirds of the people in the land will be cut off and die, says the Lord, but a third will be left in the land. I will bring that group through the fire and make them pure, just as gold and silver are refined and purified by fire. They will call on my name, and I will answer them. I will say, These are my people, and they will say, The Lord is our God.